Welcome here to Toolkit CB and welcome back to the channel here today guys for a quick update because what I want to do is follow up on this Robert Lewandowski situation. We discussed yesterday this sort of incident with Lamine Yamal, what's been spoken about in the media and I'm really pleased to say that today very very quickly here Lewandowski has addressed some of those claims. He's been speaking whilst away on international duty with Poland and I really truly believe he's put it all to bed. I think he's very much here shut that all down very very quickly because he was asked first of all about potentially ignoring Xavi after the game against Real Sociedad. What happened then when he didn't appear to greet him after that game? And he said, first of all, I've got to distance myself from these reports. He said, because it happens not only to me, but also to many other players. He said, with the Spanish press, you get such exaggerated situations. He said, what happened was I had a doping control test. Somebody in the back was talking to me. I couldn't ignore them, but I don't want to explain myself here. He said, because there is nothing at all to say about this. So Lewandowski there drawing a line under that. And he was also asked, of course, about the Laminia Mal situation there on Sunday in the game against Salavez. Lots, of course, said after the game about that. But he said on your Mal, on that whole episode, he said there is nothing to comment on. It was a total accident that happened there out on the field. Sometimes I shout during a match, but that is completely normal. So Lewandowski there saying there's no problem at all with your Mal. And I think certainly looking at that situation there, I think there was a snap of frustration. I think Lewandowski throughout that game and recently has been very, very annoyed with the situation of the team and also the chances that he's been getting. But of course, it's good to see there that I believe now everything has been resolved between everyone. Because we know Lewandowski is a passionate guy. We know that he is a winner. That's actually one of the reasons why we so badly wanted him at the club. We want him to have high standards. We want the players here to hold each other accountable and also, of course, to hold yourself to a high standard too. And Lewandowski here, he wants to win. He wants to be at his best. He knows there's more to come from the team and from him too. But I did think it was really good here that he came out nice and early, nice and quickly here in the international break, just to comment on what we had been hearing. Because otherwise, you know, it could have gone on, it could have dragged on, the media could have made more and more and more of it. But now Lewandowski has responded. And this team, like I said yesterday, it's got to stay together. Lewandowski is a leader. He can be the man that players can look up to. Lamine Yamal can learn a lot from these players in and around him. And we all have to remain on the same path as we look to get Barca back on track. That is what each and every one of us Barca fans are looking for. So let me know in the comments down below, guys. Does that there wrap things up for you with this Lewandowski situation? I will, of course, see you soon where there will be more videos on the way. Hope you're enjoying the international break so far. I'll catch you soon. But until next time, as always, Vizca, El Barca. Oh.